Alright, so I guess I'm going to do an unboxing for the Synology RS-180 16XS Plus. So, this guy. Got a few cable things in here. Get started. Put this aside. So it looks like looks just like it does online. <laughs> Twelve bays, SATA capable. Yeah, let's see what we have on the back. Expansion plugs, SAS out, four lane LAN. Um, got two expansion slots for the ten gigabit cards. Two power supplies, redundant. Well, let's see if this opens up easily. It's gonna be tricky with the camera. Let me set this down. Yeah, so just pop this panel open. These are the hot swappable fans. Pop right out. Nifty. Easy replacement. So, all right, I'm gonna install the RAM and NICs, and that'll be a separate video. All right, so here is it completely opened up. Took out the CPU heat uh, or the air guiding plastic piece. Uh, just to take a look at the motherboard uh, It looks like a looks like a server motherboard. Well a smaller one that is um, it does have a dedicated uh, SAS uh, card, so That will probably speed things up a bit um, uh, Yeah, and then I'm going to be replacing this This RAM here and I'm going to be adding the two 10 gigabit NICs over here So the next video will show that so. Alright, so the RAM is installed, all 32 gigs, and the two 10 gigabit dual port NIC cards have also been installed. So now it's just a matter of powering this baby up and see what she can do. Well, I gotta also put some drives in too, but that's, that's the easy part. Alright, so I prepped all the hard drives, so I'm just gonna slide them on in. one at a time These six terabyte hard drives are pretty heavy. Can't wait for that 16 terabyte SSD. Solve all these spinning disk problems. All right, so all five are in. I'm only doing five drives for now. I guess now it's time to boot her up. Okay, it's uh, up and running. Sadly, the RAM I got was not compatible with it. I'm hoping I'm still within my return policy for it. Uh, but small little glitch, but nothing impossible to work around. It's 
not too loud. It's it, there's a there's a hum to it, um, but it's not like jet airplane loud. Um, so it's, it's it's manageable. Two lights on the power supply, indicating power supply health. Installing the latest. Uh, the station manager now. Alright, so it's installed. It's right here. Pulls all the way out. Oh, now I locked it. Hold on. Okay, so now I'm going to turn it on. It's new home. Alright, it's booting up. In a few seconds, all the green lights should appear. It's right, uh, right underneath the KVM here, which is kind of hard to see. It's a KVM. And there, there are the green lights. Booting up. 